Understanding Limiter Threshold in Audio Processing Hello and welcome to our language learning journey. Today, we're going to unravel the meaning behind the term limiter threshold. This phrase is commonly used in the realm of audio processing, and understanding it can be quite beneficial. So, let's dive in and explore what limiter threshold means and how it's used in real-world scenarios. Before we understand limiter threshold, it's crucial to know what a limiter is. In audio processing, a limiter is a tool that ensures the audio signal does not exceed a certain level. Think of it as a guardian of your sound, making sure it doesn't get too loud and distort. Limiters are widely used in music production, broadcasting, and live sound reinforcement. Now, let's talk about threshold. The threshold is the level at which the limiter starts to work. It's like a boundary. When the audio signal reaches this level, the limiter says, that's loud enough, and begins to prevent the volume from going any higher. The threshold setting is crucial because it determines when the limiter will engage. Combining the two concepts, Limiter threshold is essentially the point at which the limiter starts to take action on the audio signal. When the volume of your audio reaches this threshold, the limiter starts to reduce the volume, ensuring it doesn't surpass the set limit. This is incredibly important in maintaining audio quality, preventing distortion, and ensuring consistency in the loudness of audio tracks. In practical terms, Setting the right limiter threshold is vital in various audio-related fields. For example, in music production, it ensures the loud parts of a song don't overpower the quieter parts. In broadcasting, it keeps the volume levels consistent for listeners. In live performances, it prevents sudden loud sounds that could lead to audio distortion or even damage speakers. Understanding limiter threshold is key to mastering audio processing. It's not just about controlling volume, it's about preserving the clarity and quality of the sound. Whether you're into music production, broadcasting, or live performances, knowing how to set and manage the limiter threshold can make a significant difference. We hope this video has been informative and has added a valuable concept to your English language learning journey. Until next time, Keep exploring and learning.